Well, it's been quite a ride this week. That atmospheric river totally soaked in the west. Uh, and uh, here around western Washington, we saw almost 15 inches of rain up at Snoqualmie Pass between early on Monday morning and about 6 o'clock uh, Thursday morning. And not uh, too atypical of what we saw around the area, but let's see what's headed our way now. The atmospheric river looks pretty impressive in this shot, really, but it's really weakened and not bringing nearly as much moisture up, and it's gradually dissipating today, which is going to allow us to finally dry out as we head into the weekend, and we actually should get into more normal weather patterns as we head into next week. We're still in first alert mode today and tomorrow, even though it's drying out, but the river flooding is going to continue to affect a large portion of western Washington, especially into Friday. We're expecting the Skagit and Mount Vernon not to crest until sometime during the morning on Friday, and that may still be at record level. So still going to be affecting western Washington uh, because of the flooding. That might extend into the weekend. We'll have to make a decision whether or not to extend that. But we do dry out. In fact, we could have a partly sunny and dry day as we head into Saturday. And then Sunday, look for showers and sun breaks. A little weak system moves through. We have an atmospheric river brush by on Monday, which is going to give us a round of rain and snow levels probably up to about six, seven, 7,000 feet, but that's not going to cause any additional flooding. It will be wet, it looks like, as we are moving through the rest of the week, but the good news is in the snow levels. Part of the problem in the past few days has been the fact with those high snow levels, we've been dumping all this rain as rain into the river system. That's what's causing all the flooding. Is that coming directly down those rivers. Now, next week, as we see those snow levels drop, we'll be building a snowpack rather than filling the river. So we're finally getting into the weather we'd like to see this time of the year.